Well, this is a really beautiful Friday morning. There's almost no clouds in the sky. Beautiful day. And it's the heaviest pack that I've ever had. And we're going to the ice. It's 27 kilometers away, roughly. And we slept in today because we woke, we got up at uh, six o'clock. We might as well get up at three o'clock. Makes no difference. That's right. <sighs> well, let's proceed. Off we go. Let's do it. We're up to the ice. This is. I can't go to this work. The shop is to your left. And we're heading up. Like a frontier town. To us, this is the great sandy desert. Uh. Over there is a private road which belongs to Volkswagen, goes to their car testing facility on the ice cap. We're heading to the ice. It's a hard slog. We've had a hell of a day. It's seven o'clock and we've already walked about 25 k's. We've got another five to go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's do it. Hmm. This is like being lost in the desert here, except we're not lost. Yeah, well. That's why we live in civilised towns. So that if you want water, you turn the tap on. And if you want to see nice places, you turn on the television. But no. We had to see it for ourselves. Yeah. That's why we've got the hard slug through the desert. Okay, this is, well today is, what's the date today? 19th. The 19th of July. It's about 10.30pm, as you can tell. It's still fairly bright outside, even though it's raining. Today we walked from the other campsite near the ice because there was no drinking water so we had to go somewhere where there was it's a bit dry, Kangalusok is really dry at the moment and the stream that used to be here is is not anymore um, yeah, as we were walking we met some Eskimos who came here to shoot bullets into the ice cap 
and one of them gave us a piece of whale meat, which had a slightly fishy taste and fishy odour. Other than that, it's just like any other meat. And so we've pitched our tent by this nice lake. And, and I suppose if tomorrow we go to the other end of the lake. We can see the ice cap from here. We didn't record anything when we got to the ice cap because well, we're too stuck. It was too far to walk, 30 kilometers. At least we're not sort of in the state to do serious hiking at the moment. And we're too cheap to take the uh, bus back because it costs about 570 kroner. Mm. It's not worth it for 30 kilometres, 25. And even though we've got blisters, we're going to walk back. Mm -hmm. Rain, hail or shine. Well, we met some musk oxen today. And they snorted at us. Yeah. So we have to change our route slightly, deviate from our planned route. They appear everywhere, when you least expect it. Yeah. Yes, so... So that's about it. And I'm getting very sleepy. Mm. I'm not sleepy yet, but okay. we're slowly changing our body clocks from five o'clock to ten o'clock, and getting up at seven o'clock rather than three o'clock. Mm -hmm. Even though three o'clock is a very nice time to be up. Yeah. Alright, let's go to sleep.